Hey, welcome back to my home, The Boundary Between Worlds. Thank you so much for being here. So I am going to be doing the weekly horoscope reading for all your air signs. That is going to be Aquarius, Libra and Gemini. Just like usual, I will use the tarot cards, find out what is going on for you next week. And then I will use the runes and we'll find out what's going on in love for you next week. And let's just get straight into it, air signs, and see where it's at. All right, air signs, you've got a big week next week, okay? I feel like there are big changes coming. There are going to be changes. There are going to be disruptions. I feel like it's a big week. I feel like these... Are all for the for for the best right they're all allowing you to kind of move on to that next cycle and kind of and kind of renew and start again in a sense i feel like you are definitely on the right track okay and you're heading down a path next week where it, it is going to be a good week like i said even though there's so much changes even though it's disruptive even though it's kind of like the end of one cycle the start of this whole new cycle you're you're putting yourself in a place where so much good is going to come to you. I feel like it's a week where you're strong and you're able to handle everything that comes your way. And I feel like it puts you in a position where you're able to just get hit with this abundance on, on so many levels. I feel like it's going to be a week where there's just abundance coming at you left right center okay i feel like it is gonna be a really good week for you and it's a week where it's kind of like even though there's changes happening even though there are disruptions even though even you the individual are changing i feel like this is all allowing you to really step into yourself and to step into how you want your life to be to step into how you want your every day to be and to really bring your lifestyle your passion and this whole adventure all together in a sense um i do definitely feel like there's an ending but again i feel like this is an ending that has to happen i feel like it's kind of like how do you start anew when the old's still rolling on right i feel like it is an ending that's necessary it's like i said it's it's this ending of this cycle it's the start of a new i feel like there is gonna be times you know where it's kind of like accept the ending for what it is right it's allowing this birth of something new it's allowing this new cycle to begin with you and it's allowing you to really step in to so much more to step into this knowing yet unknowing all at the same time i feel like there's a reminder not to get distracted or thrown off course because like i said there is so much going on around you i feel like it's a week where it's it's kind of like even you yourself could be sitting still but it's like it's chaotic all around the environment the changes the energies but again it's all for the best i feel like it's really about just accepting what's going on and going with the flow accepting that this is the universe and you as well kind of coming in tune and choosing to harmonize choosing to reharmonize yourself your home your environment where you want to be where you want to go the lifestyle that you want and on so many fronts i feel like you're just growing you're evolving and like i said it's just this this week where i feel like it's like you've you've got this you're just I feel like you're also the energy center for a lot of people around you. I feel like you're kind of that, that how could you say it, uh, like the hearth of the home, you know. I feel like you're that center. You're that one that gravitates, even if there aren't people in your literal home environment, in your personal life, okay, in your environment. Um, I feel like you're that person that kind of, you bring the energy, you bring that mood, you can pick it back up in a sense, right? And I feel like this is what has, this is what's kind of like 
your ally that attitude is your ally because all these changes that has you going on it's like you're not fighting it you're accepting it you're understanding it okay and again there's this knowing there's this trust in more in something more i feel like a lot of you these changes are on spiritual levels as well um and i feel like you're really stepping into a place where you're deciding to respond to your purpose respond to your calling i feel like others of you a start in the cycle of finding out what is your purpose what is your calling um i feel like you're and then others of you you are just in the respond you are just in this stage of it doesn't even know if you don't see the end game right you are just trusting believing and, and, and it's more than believing because you know, right? So it kind of adds it in, in there too because it's kind of like your senses are tingling. I feel like, again, like I said, it's like this whole, there, there, there is a cycle ending, right? And there's another one beginning and remember anything is possible. Remember by the end of the week, no matter what happens, anything is possible. And this journey that you're going on next week, only need you to believe right believe and let go of anything that questions you anything that says you can't do that right fear and insecurity does not help you respond to your calling fear and insecurity only hold you back it's about taking that leap leave it behind you cleanse yourself okay you are moving into an amazing place next week and i feel like you're ready for it i feel like you're in the position where you are ready maybe a lot of you know what's already got what's already coming okay but regardless you're all ready you're all ready for it and you're on the right track and i will just whack out the runes and we'll find out what's going on with you in love Okay, once again, like I was just saying, there's a whole new birth, okay? I feel like, like I said, you're growing, you're evolving, and you're, you're kind of, whatever's going on in your life is totally happening in love as well, okay? They are, it, it, it's because you're transforming. You're on this level where you are transforming, and it is definitely showing up here, okay? You are in this brand new this, this this birth of this stage of growth, of evolution, and and it's a new dawn, okay? It's the beginning, the, the, the possibilities are endless, and you're moving into this position where it's like, I feel like you're totally aware of the, the journey that you've still got to go, right? I feel like you're, you're not being naive, right? You understand you are in still this kind of stage of transition in a sense, right? And you're accepting that, like I was saying before, even though you may not know exactly where it's going, you're allowing it to take you there. You're allowing your faith and your trust to take you there. And it's going to take you to a place that returns so much to you, okay? Um, I feel like next week has you in a position where there is so much joy around you. There is so much happiness. But I feel like there's also this this clear insight, this clear vision that shows you what to do, that illuminates where to go, what to do, and how to overcome the challenges that present themselves, okay? I feel like it does link in. It definitely, I feel like there's definitely ties to family, okay? There's family ties, family bonds that seem to come in here, all right? And seem to come in with with a bit of defense, with a bit of conflict, with a bit of headbutting, right? But I feel like it's regardless there is so much potential for the relationship there is so much potential for for love for you there is so much potential because you are putting yourself in this place where you are doing all these things for yourself you are doing all these things to allow everything to come to you to allow the universe to gift you as well okay and i feel like others of you you know you're you're really manifesting others of you you're really looking and using manifesting and bringing that into love and bringing that into into where where it is you want to go right but regardless i feel like next week has you in this place where 
You are just oozing this passion. You are oozing this warmth and you are oozing this energy that is so attractive to people that people are going to want to come be part of. They're going to want to come be near you to share in that, to share in you and what you're putting off, right? I feel like regardless, you have so much coming to you. You have, yeah, I feel like there are, you know, sometimes there's, like everything, sometimes there's sacrifices that need to be made, but I feel like these pay off with what you gain, right? Regardless, I feel like you go into a place where it's not really about sacrifices. I feel like you're in a place where it's just about enjoying all that is coming to you. And yeah, that's everything. Thank you so much for watching. I really, really appreciate you. Uh, please hit that subscribe button. That is the best way that you can help me out. And yeah, most of all, thank you for your time. You are so special. See you later.